raise. <laughs> Have you ever seen anything done like this? This just looks like bad idea written all over it. Keep her coming! Well, it's gonna be all hands on deck for this job. They weren't lying when they said it was gonna be a foot and a half of snow. It is unbelievable. I can't believe I made it here, number one. Uh, they plowed the roads, but the driveway, I had to come through there and drug the TRX's belly pan all the way. Then I decided it was a bad idea and then I just parked it right there. Look at this. That's pretty much what the whole yard looks like. And then areas of maybe three to four feet, like over there, where it's drifted off that pile. And then, oh, oh. oh. Anyways, I've got to go to Dad's first to get him unburied because he, he literally can't get out of his yard. He normally is able to find a way out, but he cannot. So I'm going to take the tractor over there, blow his yard out so that he can come here and help me. I think Brody's coming out. We're gonna have to get the payloader and this out if we have any chance of, is there any chance of being able to haul tomorrow? Probably not, but gotta start somewhere. Just doesn't even look fun out there. Look at how much snow I pushed up just literally clearing, clearing this whole one door. Oh my gosh, what are we gonna do with it? This is ridiculous. This is like mountainous amounts of snowfall. The only good thing is it's super light and fluffy. It's not like that heavy stuff. So it should be easy to move. and just jet it straight in the air as high as we can a lot of it looks like it's kind of blowing away is what I'm hoping all right Brody just showed up so we made a game plan he's gonna jump in the payloader I'm heading over to dad's to bail him out so then we have more help and uh, Brody's just gonna pile up stuff for the blower to blow away. This stuff is super light, super light. Which is also why it's drifting so easy. I'm on the way to go rescue Duggo, and I honestly, I can't say I've ever been on an unplowed road with a tractor before, but look at this. Dad's like, whatever you do, don't lower the pusher down. I've done that before at full speed and it all comes over the cab and you can't see nothing and you almost crash. Okay, I don't know why you try that anyways, but uh, yes sir. <laughs> this is fun. This is fun. I'm having fun. I made it. What do you think? I'm going to let you wreck stuff here. I can shovel. Are you still sick? It's not good. <clears throat> Pretty bad. Yeah, stay away. This is deep! It's horrible. <laughs> I think we're gonna try to stick the big MDS bucket in here and back drag. And scratch your floor? No, no, you keep me off of that. I wouldn't touch that either. <laughs> All I right, got I'll... the Clorox wipes up there on the pickup, but you might want to wipe the outside container off. I clean the inside of my pickup down. Oh, I can't believe it. It ain't too bad, as long as I have a nap every hour and a half, I'm good. I think you got the vid. <clears throat> I think it's the, the N, the N1, the N19, the N, <laughs> it's the N. <laughs> the H1N1? I don't know, but it ain't good. Get in that thing now, okay. come on! What if, if I'm never seen again, look for me in this spot. I feel it's best to have him, uh, 
wreck his own place instead of me. He's not looking. Oh! It's on the cement! Woo! That makes for a lot less shoveling. But he's definitely not going to make it in that door. I don't know what he's planning on doing there. He can't even see me. is just too big for up here. He needs to invest in one of them overpriced little yard tractors like I have. Overpriced is the right word for them. But they're nice. And you don't feel like you're just going to destroy everything. Too big. It's just too big. in the winter. Oh my gosh. Woo! What a beautiful day. Oh, it's not nice out here. <laughs> That's enough of being up there. It's literally like I think 25 below windshield or hit something terrible and I feel it. So he's got to blow his place out, two neighbors here, and then go back to the farm. So he knows the yard. I got plenty to push with at the farm. So I'm, I'm going to take his pickup and try to brave that unplowed road back to the farm. I'm going to try and make it to the farm then or you need something. I can take my pickup. How about all this stuff up here? What stuff? There's a mellow yellow. That's empty. Water. That's you can have if you need. I might need that. Yeah, yeah. See ya. Good luck. <laughs> the question is, is how am I gonna breathe in there? It'll be a long way to the farm to not breathe. My brother's sick, my mom's sick, dad's sick. It's just a disease fest. Oh, I just took my glove off. Where's his opener? Wh which button do you think it is, guys? Any of these? Oh, that. Oh, I think it's this one. I can't touch that. What button is it? Oh, there we go. This is just so horrible. Oh, thank goodness. I don't know if you can see, but right up there is the snow plow. Ah, oh, finally. Nice driving. Well, as nice as it can get in the middle of a blizzard. Come on, man. Only one more mile. Oh, it's the county line. I suppose. Now the fun begins. The tractor made this look a lot easier. <laughs> this is so much fun. Right here by this grove is where it always piles in just stupid deep. It's amazing how much we can go through here. It's so fluffy. Okay, we're good. We made it through there, we'll make it the rest of the way. Oh, there's Brody. He's just making massive piles. Look at this. Just a massive pile in the middle of the yard. Bobcat time. Here we go. 
little hard to have nice things. bit of size difference here. <laughs> You'd almost swear that's Eric driving it. Just full, full throttle. speed things up a lot. Brody's having so much fun. <laughs> I feel like a little turtle in this thing compared to what that can push. I asked him what we're gonna do with the giant pile in the middle of the yard and he's like, I don't know. Let's see if he can make it through it. we just screw off having fun with our new toy. Little bit of loss of traction. Oh, it's cold. I'm cold. I'm getting out in the bobcat. Well, me and Brody are getting there. I think we're about done. Randy and his son are shoveling doors out, but look at this. Like actually look at the size of this wall of snow that we pushed off this yard this winter and a lot of this is just this storm. And that payloader can get it high. It's windy out and there's no wind even here because of the big wall. Oh yeah. But we do have piles that dad needs to blow away just because we don't want piles over there. And it's a pretty steep drop off the driveway where the payloader and the skid loader might get stuck. I should call him, see where he's at. Well, update on the rest of the day. Dad uh, finished blowing those piles. Me and Brody put new openers on this thing. I am so disappointed in the product quality of these things. Out of 24 rows, we had four defective ones that were so warped or not centered that we couldn't get the pinch point properly. There's just got to be something better than those things. It's just terrible. And that's not saying that they're all perfect either, but I think that's going to be it for the video, guys. Hope you enjoyed our massive snowstorm, and we'll see you in the next one.